This is Nere from the Glasgow Scene Guild, and I'm here to show how to use the Procyon to turn mono signals into stereo, or to run already existing stereo signal and uh, add some extra weight to them uh, through stereo filtering. Um, and to do that, we're gonna build up a patch that replicates some some kind of traditional behavior that you'd find on in low-pass gates. So. Uh, at the core of the patch, I have the crew in, which right now I run without phase modulation. So it's basically a dual mono sawtooth wave uh, through a wave folder to the Procyon, and then the Procyon left and right up goes to a stereo delay. Um, I have an envelope from the sequence, which normalizes, uh, goes to the VCA uh, CV input, and that CV input normalizes to the FM input. So if I turn off the resonance, we now have sort of like a classic low-pass low -pass filter and add some resonance and some of that envelope you know get that kind of resonant low-pass gate type of characteristic sounds uh, and finally you can use the spread control so the spread control with no CV patched in if I turn it to the right then the right channel frequency goes up and the left channel goes down if I turn the spread control to the left then the left channel frequency goes up and the right goes down if I patch uh, an LFO from the Pony VCO to the spread CV then you can start to animate that mono signal to stereo and add that kind of left to right movement So finally, if uh, you now remove that spread animation, I'm going to introduce some phase modulation to the crew in, so I now have a stereo VCO, uh, so two super so sawtooth waves going to the wave folders, the Procyon, so a fully stereo signal path, so I get this kind of... signal to which I can introduce some extra width through the spread control. 